Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Tori. Today's video is going to be my Christmas 2023 haul. I do have a little helper here as you can see. <laughs> she was like up on my shoulder. I don't know if I'll cut that part out, but I was like giggling really hard because she like climbed up here. But um, sorry if you have the girls in the background. They are in the living room playing. I'll actually get up and shut the door so hopefully it won't be so loud. But yeah, let's get into this haul. <laughs> So I think the way that I'm gonna do this haul is I'm going to do it per store rather than per item. Like I was thinking about either doing like all the decor and then all the ornaments and so on, but I think instead I'm gonna organize it per store so that I can do timestamps so that if anybody's like wanting to know what's at Target that I got or what's at TJ Maxx that I got or whatever. Um, so that's why I'm gonna lay it out. And I also will mention that I did make quite a bit of returns. So if there is something that you saw me buy in one of my shopping videos that is not included in the haul, that is because I I probably returned it um sometimes we just love things in the store we get home and try to style it and it's not exactly what we were thinking anymore so that's why I returned a lot of things and again I'm sorry the girls are just having the time of their life out there and um I'm super late getting this video out I planned on having this up Wednesday <laughs> and I don't even know what day it's gonna go up um, and then I had planned on doing it for Friday's video because I wanted to get on a posting schedule but I had an interview at a local OBGYN clinic which went awesome don't know if I'll get it fingers crossed but there was a couple other girls there interviewing so we'll see but um, then I got sick I had like a little 24 hour flu or something that I was just I was I was down like it was bad and also like my comments to be honest have been off the chain lately <laughs> my comments have been off the chain lately so I was a little bit bummed out about that so it's sometimes it's hard to want to pick up the camera and film a video whenever your comments have just been so not nice lately um about 95 percent of them have been very nice and I you know love you guys so much and then there's this that five percent that's just like what are you doing here <laughs> you know like if you hate me so much why are you here watching anyway so Violet's like messing with these bags down here. So I'm going to start with, I think I only have one item from Walmart. So I'm going to start with that one. So here is the one Walmart item that I got this year. It is this black deer. It is a lot like the ones I got at Big Lots, but those are gold and they're like the ones from Pottery Barn. <laughs> the girls are being so loud in the background. I hope it's not bothering y'all. It's not bothering me. I just don't want it to bother you guys. But, um, I actually had to get this one at a Walmart that was an hour away. We do have three Walmarts here. None of them had it. I don't know if they just never carried it or if it was just out of stock, but this is the only Walmart item that I got this year. I love it. It was like 14 something, 14, I don't know, 14.98. So love that. I think it's so perfect. I think I'm going to use it in the bedroom because that's kind of the theme, the vibe we were going for in here. But yeah, I really like this. So next I have Big Lots and I did get these two deer from Big Lots. So this one is originally $12.99. And this one's originally $19.99, but I did get these on sale 20% um, off and then an additional $10, $10 off of my purchase. And I also got a candle uh, from Big Lots. So I'll show you that real quick. So I also got this candle and the scent is sparkling, sparkling cinnamon. And the candle was originally $9.99. I did also buy a sign. I ended up returning the sign because when I got home and I just like wasn't feeling it anymore as much as I was in the store. But that's okay. That's why we're allowed to make returns. But this candle oh, it smells so good. It smells so, so good. But it's also just a really pretty candle. But I was like hesitant to buy it because it is a little bit hard to put back on. But you could just take this thing off and then it's like super easy to go on and off <laughs> but also I, I feel like with candles I mentioned that I just have so many candles because I do and I like I'm on a, like a no candle buying streak which I'm obviously not doing very good at because I have two candles to show you guys today but I was thinking that um like I'm I'm allowing myself to buy candles if they can be used as decor and like as long as you know whenever the candles burn out of this one I can just keep it like it's you know just cute on its own so that's kind of like my little candle rule because I just have so many candles over the years I've just bought so many that I like have a bunch of them that have like that much left in them that need to be burned but yeah so let me show you those deers again really quick see it's so hard to get back on there it's like the hardest thing ever to get back on there so these deers are like a lot like the ones at Pottery Barn. I actually have quite a bit of Pottery Barn dupes in today's video, but these are just so beautiful. I love them so much. I think I have an idea for these. I think I'm gonna use these in the living room and then the black one I wanna use here in the bedroom, I think. But here's just a better view of the gold one. It's just absolutely beautiful. I love it so much. Such good quality, especially for Big Lots and especially what I paid for it because I got it 
This was $19.99 and then $12.99 and then the candle was $9.99 so I got 20% off plus an additional $10 off my purchase. So it's a really good deal. With that sign, the sign was like $12.99. With the sign, everything was $34 but I did return and got like $8 back for the sign I do believe. Um, but yeah, that was a really, really good deal. So I'm just going to do Ross really quick because I only found one item from Ross and it is this bell. I saw this and I was like, I have to have this. It's so pretty. It was only $7.99, but this is honestly the only, usually Ross, to me, usually I find so much good stuff there, especially for Christmas. I love this. I'm thinking about cutting this jute off and tying on some different ribbon, like maybe some red velvet ribbon or some chiffon ribbon. It's so funny that like last time I said chiffon ribbon and so many people corrected me and it's so funny that I say chiffon ribbon, but whenever like we had the pumpkin chiffon coffee, like I said it, I don't know. I don't know y'all y'all just uh, people correct me all the time it's so funny the amount of words I don't even realize I'm saying wrong. <laughs> but it's funny that like it's like it's like the Pirates of the Caribbean Pirates of the Caribbean I don't know like you say Caribbean or Caribbean like just the way you pronounce things like when you say it like different <laughs> like, I don't know it's just weird to me but like whenever I was saying pumpkin chiffon coffee I was saying it right and then I was saying chiffon ribbon and people were like it's pronounced chiffon <laughs> so I don't know but some chiffon ribbon would be really cute on this as well. I just thought it was so pretty. I love the like antique gold and I honestly think that you could hang it somewhere but it's like so loud. I'm trying not to make it like ring. <laughs> you could just like hang it on something or also just set it down somewhere which would be really pretty just on its own honestly but I really liked this. So next we have Target and I did get these cute little houses and they are just the cutest thing ever. I actually did meet one of my sweet subscribers whenever I was shopping for these and she was like, I didn't realize you lived here. Like it's such a small world. It was just the coolest thing. And she even had to take a selfie to send to her sister and that just made my day. But so shout out to Valerie if you're watching this. It was really nice meeting you. Um, that's actually happened a lot lately. Like I, I guess the more your channel grows, the more people recognize you. I've had that happen I think like three times in the last month. I was one time at Kirkland's where I was shopping and a girl was like, you do decorating videos on YouTube, don't you? And I was like, yes, I do. And she's like, I recognized your voice. And then I had another couple that I saw at TJ Maxx that said they've seen my videos and then now this one. So I guess that I'm getting to that point where people are starting to recognize me, which is super crazy. I don't know. I just never thought that I would even get to that point. But back to the haul, <laughs> I did get these cute little houses and they were $5 each and they do have a timer setting on them, which I think is super awesome love the texture on them i think they're just the cutest thing ever i wanted some little light up houses like this and i'm actually really glad that i found these because i love the texture i think they're the cutest thing ever i like these so much better than the ones at hobby lobby because they just have so much texture on them and then the colors they're just like i don't know how to explain it like the ones at hobby lobby are just like white and they have like glitter on them but these are just the cutest thing ever and you, they were five dollars each so you can get there's three different styles of houses and then they do have the little church which is super cute love that i think that's adorable and i also did get i also did get the little tree that matches as well and this one was ten dollars and these were all from the wonder shop at target I love them. I think they're just the cutest thing ever. So just a couple more things from Target. So the next thing I have from Target are these stockings and these were $14.99 each. I did pick up one of each because I actually ordered our stockings from Amazon. So I'll be doing an Amazon haul um, probably in the next few days. But these I got because I was like obsessed with them. <laughs> and I was like, dang, I already ordered stockings on Amazon. And I really love traditional colors to be honest but we're doing like more of a neutral vibe in our bedroom. So I think these are perfect for like just some stockings to go. Like when we style our dresser, I usually style it sort of like a mantle so I can hang them off of our dresser. And I just think they're so pretty. I love them. They're from the Hearth and Hand line at Target. And they were, if I didn't already say, they were $14.99. And I just think they're so cute. Like all this stuff together is so cute. Like I might have to use these like to decorate in the bedroom and then probably again in the, cause I was thinking about using them on the hutch. Like I'll insert the idea that I saw on Pinterest that actually like made me search for little houses like this. It was just like, I love it. It was just perfect. <laughs> So next I have Bell's Outlet and I guess it's it's not Bell's Outlet anymore. It's called Bell's now. It's going to be a hard habit to break calling it Bell's Outlet, but they did change their name. But I got this pillow and it was $19.99 and it's like a velvety soft. I've got cat hair on it already. Nothing new, <laughs> but it's got like Merry Christmas and gold letters. I did actually buy quite a bit from Bell's Outlet and I did end up taking most of it back. Because like I said, I just got home and I sort of like styled it how I planned, like the gingerbread stuff, the nutcracker stuff, I played around with it and I styled it. I just wasn't loving it the way that I was, I don't know, I was envisioning something different and it came out 
just not, I wasn't loving it. And I've gotten to where I'm a lot more intentional about my buying. So I did return those items and I don't regret returning them. I'm actually pretty happy about it, <laughs> but I'm happy about the stuff that I ended up keeping and I don't really plan on buying any more. So I figured go ahead and film a haul and get that up. So I really love this pillow. I do have a green version of this already and it says Merry and Bright, I believe also in gold letters. So I plan on using these on our couch because we have a white couch. I just think the green and the red Will really pop and we'll have like our big Santa painting from Hobby Lobby which I'll show in a little bit love it so much <laughs> but yeah that was my Bell's Outlet item or Bell's item this is my one Bell's item <laughs> so I just got a couple of things from Michael's including these little bouquets um they were only I think five dollars after the discount so they were originally $9.99 I do believe they were half off and they're just so cute I feel like they're perfect to go like in my minka pots or whatever they're definitely like the vibe I was going for like the greenery the realistic look and y'all know I love eucalyptus uh, so they have like a little bit of eucalyptus and they got the red berries and the little pine cones I just thought those were so cute so perfect so I was thinking like maybe on my coffee table or that little vase in the kitchen my minka pot in the kitchen and I just thought these would be perfect and I couldn't go wrong with these <laughs> also from Michaels I have this beautiful mailbox I love this thing so much it's like one of my favorite things it was originally $29.99 but I did get it 40% off and it does actually open up it's kind of hard but it does open up which is so cool so the girls can i've already told them they got we got our little target and amazon catalogs in the mail you know they send those out like toy guys or whatever this time of year and we already got those they've already started circling things so i told them they're gonna have to make their little list for santa put it in the mailbox and um get those mail, get those mailed off to santa so now i can like show them where i'm opening it up and mailing it to santa um anyways i just think that is so cute I love like the antique look to it it's so beautiful and then I also have this from Michaels I also got two of these six foot garlands because I know they're like super sparkly but I just love them I, I love the realistic look to them and I do have an idea for these um so you'll have to stay tuned to figure out what that is <laughs> but I do have an idea for these and I'm really excited about it but I love these so much and they were originally $19.99 and I got two of them so they were 40% off as well actually I don't think these were on sale but they did have a 40% off your entire purchase coupon that day I do believe because I ended up having to like bring it up on my phone and scan it so I did get these 40% off but I love the realistic look to them and honestly the sparkles don't really bother me I think they're kind of magical but yeah I really love these so next we have Kirkland's and I did get a few things from Kirkland's I got five of these realistic Norfolk pine garlands I believe they're five foot, maybe six foot. I think five foot, five foot. So these are originally $39.99, which if you know, they are a dupe to the ones that a floral. I did get mine over the summer though. And I think that the discount brought them down to like $25 each. So I did snag five of these. Honestly, I wish I would have grabbed more, but I was thinking that I could just get five of them and like do my decorating video in one area and then move them to another area. And then I'll probably just for this season, leave them in the living room um, because that's where we spend most of our time. But um, I was thinking that I could just add a few to my collection each year, um, just so I don't have to spend so much money at once. I love these. I feel like they're so realistic looking. They're beautiful. They feel real. They look real. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love how flowy they are. But I also got, um, so I'll show you in a second, I also got the stems and the wreath to match. So here is the wreath and it actually does have little lights on it. So I'll turn those on really quick so you can see. I think I have them on the timer setting right now. Um, so mine is actually missing a few lights, like the whole bottom half is not lighting up, but that's okay. I'm just going to add some lights to it. So I actually did get this on sale too. It's originally $69.99, originally $69.99, and I did get it 30% off. So I think it came down to like 50 something dollars, but it also just has that like realistic feel to it, realistic look to it, and it has lights on it. So beautiful. I just love these so much. I just, I'm so excited. I can't wait. I think this one is going to go in my kitchen probably, most likely. And then I want to find a wreath to go on the front door. And then I also maybe want to find one to go on the hutch because I think that little idea I had, I think if it's the one I'm thinking of, had like a wreath on the hutch and it'll be so pretty. But I would love it if I could find one like this, maybe a little bit smaller, but I have yet to find one. So we'll see. But I really love these Norfolk pine items. I think they're beautiful and they're really, really, really good affordable dupe to the a floral ones because those are very expensive <laughs> so i do also have the stems that match those as well and this is just two of them that i'm showing here these are 9.99 each but so <laughs> i have six of them and i got two of uh, two of them i paid full price for because 
they were like the last ones they had in stock and I was like I really could use a couple more to fill in like my makeup pot because I styled it and it was just a little sparse looking but for the other four I actually did get them like almost half off because I had I think I had a $20 coupon expiring like the next day so it was like something like that. I got four of them. So four, $40 and then $20 off. So I got them like half off cause they weren't on sale, but I had a $20 coupon, but these are so realistic and so beautiful. And I love them. I love how like big of a statement they make, like even just two of them here, like make such a big statement. They're just so pretty. I love these. I feel like they're just like ugh, the perfect Christmas dim. <laughs> So I believe the last two stores we have are TJ Maxx and Hobby Lobby. So I'm going to do TJ Maxx because I think I have the most from Hobby Lobby. So I'll do TJ Maxx really quick and then we'll get into Hobby Lobby, which is probably going to be the biggest part of the haul. The first thing from TJ Maxx is this massive gold bell candle. I could not believe I found this. It is so beautiful and I love it. I'm like, it actually doesn't smell like a Christmas candle to me. And then Lewis agrees that it smells more like a summer scent. It's called Amber Sunset. It really does smell like kind of like beachy, like florally. Anyways, it smells good. And like I said earlier, this is the, this one and the red Christmas tree candle are the only candles I bought this year because I think that if I could like, you know, get away with it, be, just look at this candle. Like I could not, and it was $16.99 too. Cause I, whenever I saw it, I ran to it. Cause I was like, wait a minute, what is that? I ran to it. I picked it up. I was like, oh my gosh, it's a candle. It's massive. It's huge. It's heavy. And I was thinking, surely it's like $25, like $24.99 was what I was thinking. I picked it up, $16.99. I was like, oh yeah, this is coming home with me. <laughs> I love it. I think I, again, will cut the jute off. Or actually, I won't even have to cut this one off. It's tied on pretty loose. But I think I'm going to tie on like some red velvet ribbon or something like that. I just think this is the cutest thing ever. They also do have a version of this at Pottery Barn. So this is a really, really affordable Pottery Barn dupe because I don't even know how much that one is, but it's probably very expensive love it love me some pottery barn i'm not bougie enough for pottery barn but i love to find things that remind me of pottery barn and this is one of those things speaking of pottery barn they also have their version of these and i also have a red one that i'll show you in just a second so the larger one is 14.99 and then the smaller one was 12.99 and they do light up and they're like this clear like um crackly kind of glass and they're just beautiful and I just can't wait to style these and I also show you the red ones so they do have a version of these at Pottery Barn that's these are a lot more affordable I love them like I said I love all things Pottery Barn so let me show you the red one really quick okay look how cute this is like this is the cutest thing ever I love it it's sort of like kind of like like catacorner looking or like crooked looking and it's kind of got like more of a mercury glass look to it which I really love I think it's so beautiful and again it just reminds me of those ones that I saw at Pottery Barn a lot more affordable love this thing it was $12.99 which I thought was a steal for this I think it's so cute I honestly wish I could find like a dark green one I think that would be so perfect so I might keep checking back but also I already have three of them so I think I'm good <laughs> but I really love this one so next I have this light up tree which I am obsessed with I saw this it's like mercury glass also and this one was $16.99 I just love all things that light up this year you'll see I have another one from Hobby Lobby I love these I just think they're so beautiful and they're so like classic I feel like I'll use them year after year and I wonder does this one have yeah it does have <laughs> I can't remember if I put batteries in it or not so this one does have batteries in it I need to go buy some batteries we're always just looking for batteries around here like between the remotes and the game controllers and toys and all, all the things always looking for batteries around here so I did put batteries in this one but um I love it I don't know exactly where I'm gonna use these yet but I definitely have a few ideas that I'm really excited about <laughs> So next I have this little guy and he was $6.99. He was one of those things that I didn't buy because in the store I was thinking, oh, I'm going to get all those comments about how ugly he is. Just like I did on the Hobby Lobby video where I bought those nutcrackers um, that everybody was like, oh, those are so ugly. Um, but I went back and he, there was a bunch of them the first time I went and like that video where I ended up putting them back. And then I went back and he was the only one. So I was like, you know what, let me buy him. And then if I, um, get home and realize I don't like him anymore or whatever. I can always take him back. I have not decided to take him back. So I do wish I would have just bought the ones I found originally because they were prettier than him. Like he's a little bit more roughed up looking, but I don't know. I just, I guess I let those comments get to me that they were, they just kept calling those the velvet ones that I found at Hobby Lobby. I got so many comments about how ugly those were. And I guess it was like, I don't know. It was like one of those things that I thought people were going to think he was ugly. So, but he made me happy. So I went back and got him and I just, I like him. I'm going to style him somewhere. I don't know where yet, but I just think he'll be the perfect little piece to add in somewhere. 
So next I have this Christmas uh, soap dispenser. It does actually have soap in it. So it was $6.99 and it has like little gold speckles. I don't know if you can really tell, but it does have gold speckles. It also has like a gold pump and the scent is Nordic spruce and it smells really good like a Christmas tree. And it was $6.99, I think. Yeah, $6.99. $6.99 and my, th my thought process with this is like I don't need it because I always use Bath & Body Works uh, foaming hand soap but I'm actually on a no buying streak for that right now because I have so many just like the candles I just have so many let's use them up before we buy any more but I was thinking we could use the soap until it's all gone out of this one and then in the future like I could just fill it with like seasonal dish soap like Mrs. Myers, Iowa Pine or whatever and then we could use it for our dish soap dispenser during the holidays so I thought that was really cute and it's just like a classic thing like just green Christmas tree, just classic. It'll like always be, you know, in style. <laughs> so next I have this Ray Dunn mug and this was $5.99. I love the little simple font this one has on it. It says Merry Christmas and it's just so cute. I love the little lowercase simple font. So I got this because I don't have a lot of Christmas mugs. I did part with a lot of my mugs. I think I only have like a Mickey Mouse one and two other little ones. So then now we'll have four mugs. So that's perfect. One for each of us to drink our hot cocoa out of. And I, I just really love it. If you know, like if you're one of my like OG subscribers, you know, I used to love Ray Dunn, collected Ray Dunn. I had so much stuff, but it's like, it's just nostalgic to me at this point. Cause I also have my Halloween one that I use during the fall time that says lazy bones on it. So now I have a Christmas one. So next from TJ Maxx, I found this nativity scene and I literally love this thing so much. It was $24.99 and it's sort of made of like a driftwood material. I love how like rustic it looks. And then the little people, <laughs> the little people in it are like made of like, I don't even know what they're made of, but they're like, I, I wonder whenever I picked it up, I was like, are they going to be removable? And no, they're like stuck down in there and there's like, hey, everything's just like, it's put together really well. Like I was worried that it was going to like come apart really easy, but so far so good. I really love this. I wanted one of these to go like on my entryway. I just thought that'd be really pretty there. And I really searched for one, like I wanted a rustic one. And to me, this one was perfect for that style that I was going for because I just really wanted a beautiful nativity scene that we can put out on the entryway table each year. And I just think this is so pretty. So the next thing I found is this little star to go on our tree in the bedroom, I do believe. That's where I'm going to put this one. This one was $12.99 and I love this. It's made of like a natural material. I just think it's so perfect for the vibe we're going. You'll see like throughout the video, like the vibe we're going for in our bedroom. Um, my husband really likes neutral colors, especially for Christmas. So I let him have it with the neutral colors in the bedroom. And then I get to do all the red and greens out in the rest of the house. But he doesn't mind the reds and the greens either. He just really prefers like the neutral colors. He says it's really calming to him so I love this I got this to go on our tree in here and I'm so excited about that I'm also really excited I did get a tree I got two trees from Hobby Lobby um you probably saw I've mentioned it a handful of times I was gonna buy that one with the rainbow lights that changes colors um I got that one that's gonna go in the girls room I do believe and then I got the one that was next to it for our room it's more of a like realistic tree with like white light so this will go on top of that one and I'll get to in the Hobby Lobby part I'll get to the ornaments and stuff that I got for that tree but I'm really excited about this. So I found these ornaments the other day whenever I was at TJ Maxx and I was totally obsessed with them. They're $14.99. I think they're absolutely gorgeous. I love these. They've got like mercury glass. They've got you probably can't tell maybe I'll pull some out and try to show you up close but they've got like some that just have like a distressed looking texture on them and they got like gold and red and silver just the perfect colors I don't know if they're glass ornaments I think they are because uh so this one's Martha Stewart and this one is like tinsel and fur and it just says set of nine ornaments it doesn't say glass ornaments it doesn't say shatterproof so they were $14.99 each but I think they're glass because they're heavy they're good quality I do think they're glass ornaments so I think I'm going to use these as bowl filler uh, more so like for a decorative purpose more so than like sorry my eyes itching <laughs> more so than like tree decorations because I do have four cats and two kids and I actually did return those glass ornaments for um I had got them to go in our bedroom because I was thinking with the carpet they'd be safer but I ended up returning them because I bought some different ornaments because we're not doing the red in here we're just doing the neutral colors so I ended up returning those which I'm really sad because I wanted to use them but again I I'm just throwing my money away if I put glass ornaments on the tree because my cats are going to climb the Christmas tree and they're going to knock it down <laughs> Hopefully not. We'll see. But um, if you're a cat parent, then you totally understand. But I'm going to pull these out of the box and try to get some up close pictures of them so you guys could see them. So the next thing for actually the last thing from TJ Maxx are these ornaments. And I don't know if you can see. I might have to show like up close shots. But these were $39.99. But it did come with 96 shatterproof ornaments. 
and I love them. I just think they're beautiful. There's like a disco ball looking one. I really love this white one here. I think I'm pointing to it. I just love them all so much. So I think these are gonna go on the tree in the dining room. I think that'll look really good in there. So I saw these and I was like 96 ornaments and they're good size ornaments. Like they're, I mean, they're like the bigger size. They're not the tiny size, but I love these so much. I thought that was such a good deal for all these ornaments. So I'm starting on the Hobby Lobby part and I'm gonna try to show him best I can <laughs> without having to like, I don't know, like readjust the camera angle. But I have this huge Santa painting and he is gorgeous. He's like my favorite thing ever. Love him so much. I've wanted him forever and I finally have him. He was $80, which is a little bit of a splurge, but honestly for the size, I think he is totally worth every penny. Love him so much. I feel like all these colors is kind of like where I got the idea for my vibe for my Christmas decor this year. I just love him so much and I'm so glad I bought him and I'm sure a lot of you are too. So I have a lot more good stuff from Hobby Lobby. I feel like I bought the most from Hobby Lobby. I'm trying to debate on if I want to start with the ornaments or the decor because everything is just so cute. <laughs> I'll probably start with the decor because I feel like that is like sort of how I've been doing it and then doing the ornaments. But um, so first thing was this light up tree. I think it's one of the first things I bought. It's like that mercury glass light up tree. Um, this was originally $34.99, but I did get it half off and well, it's not really working, but it does light up. <laughs> so I'll have to put some batteries in that so I can use that, but I'll probably use it with my other red one from TJ Maxx. I did get this Christmas tree like cutting board. It was originally $17.99, again, half off. Actually, let me just mention so I don't have to keep repeating. Everything from Hobby Lobby was half off. So um, so if I say it was like $17.99, that just means it was like half of whatever that is. Actually, scratch what I just said. I did pay full, I did pay full price for these because I have never seen these go on sale, y'all. I have wanted them forever for my Christmas decor. And I even asked them, I was like, do these ever go on sale? And they said that they don't know, that they just kind of changed the way that they've been doing their sales. So this one was $10.99 and $9.99. So I really feel like that wasn't a bad deal for these bells. If you've seen my like shopping style videos, you've seen me use these a lot. So I actually picked up a set because I thought they were so cute for Christmas decor, but honestly they could be used year round. Love these, so I had to get a set of these, but I did again, I know I just said everything is half off, but I did, I think these are the only things I paid full price for. I did snag a set of these little bells. These were $7.99 and then they were half off. And then I got one of these bigger bells, which was originally $15.99. And I wish I would have grabbed more because these sold out so, so quick. So if your store still has these and you're wanting them, definitely grab them because they're gonna sell out really quick. I even asked them when I was there the other day if they were gonna be put out anymore and they said, unfortunately, know that they're all sold out but I love these I think they're so pretty I did end up ordering some big ones on Amazon so those are you know just one of those things that I really want to decorate with this year like the gold bells I just think they're so pretty I did find these black deer and I actually didn't see these like originally they were $10.99 originally um and then I was there the other day just kind of looking for like last minute little things and I saw these and I was like oh my gosh these are so perfect I'm gonna like take one out of the package so I can show you like up close See how pretty these are? They're like matte black. I'm not sure what material they're made of, but I love these. I think they're perfect, especially because we're kind of going for like that, like kind of woodland, like cozy cabin sort of vibe in our room. Sorry if I'm talking funny. I have a sore on my tongue and it's making me feel like I'm talking funny. Um, but that's the kind of vibe we're going for in our room. And like, that was why also why I wanted the black um, deer from Walmart. Cause I was like, that'd be perfect for our room because like that's sort of the vibe I was going for in here because we have the black sheets. So we've got like black on our rug. I love that. I just think it's gonna be so cute. Okay, I just went on a total rant, but let me cut that part out and <laughs> get back to the haul. <laughs> My comments have just been off the chain lately, y'all, and I won't even put the rain in there, but this was $28.99. I got it 40% off, but I have went back and forth with this. I finally got it because it was one of those things. I feel like if I just keep going back to it, that it's something I'm going to love for years and I'm going to use it. So I got that to go with my Christmas decor. Um, and then the next couple of things are like, I guess I'll do like the picks because I only have a couple of those. I bought these picks. I got like a handful of them. These were originally $3.99 and then so that brought them down to $2. I think I got like eight of them or so total. And then these, I think I got a bunch, like these little bells. I'm planning on using these like everywhere. These were originally $5.99, so they were $3 each. And I got, I don't even know how many y'all, probably like not 20, but definitely more than 10. <laughs> I think I got like 16 of them because I, I bought 10 originally and then I went back and got more because I had more ideas for them. But I feel like they were the perfect thing just to add 
that gold like bell touch to things and they were so affordable love those the only other pick that i got was these little like dark red berries and this was originally a dollar 99 and i also got these like stems so this one i love these this one was a lot more affordable at 5.99 so three dollars uh for this stem and it's like longer and then this one was a little bit more pricey so i originally so these were 12.99 originally so i originally had like a bunch of these in my cart like I don't even know like eight of them because I was gonna fill up that big vase in my entryway but I was like hang on I have an idea I was like let's make this a lot more affordable so instead of having like eight of these filling up a vase in my entryway I took three of them and then I took a handful of these other ones and like put them together and it actually looks really beautiful and then stick these berries in it and just kind of make a mixture of them and I played around with it obviously it made it a lot more affordable because buying uh, like eight of these versus buying like three of these and four of these was a lot more affordable because these are three dollars and these were what's these were 750 so seven these were like less than half the price so a lot more affordable but I love these I feel like they just look so realistic and so beautiful for the price love these I love the pine cones but I also really love red so I added the red the red berries so I got the dark red I don't know I don't know if I'll go back and get some more red berry picks because I only got a handful of these I might need some more of these I did pick up a pack of these little ornaments and they're all kind of crazy in the box because I already opened them <laughs> but these were originally $5.99 so $3 for this whole pack of ornaments I do have a couple of ideas for these so um I think they're really cute I like the dark like sort of moodier colors and like the different kind of like there's the matte and the shiny love these I thought they were so cute I did pick up these deer ornaments I got I think I ended up with five of these and two of these because that was all they had left these were originally $5.99 so three dollars each and I love them I love the color they're sort of like it's hard to like pinpoint the color they're sort of like brown sort of sparkly got a little bit of gold like bronzy I don't know they're pretty I love them I think they're gonna go good on our tree here in the bedroom because that's the kind of vibe we're going for in here but I thought these were really cute okay so getting into ornaments y'all I'm so excited so I got these right I found two of these they had two packs left they're that dark brown velvet flocked ornaments that are really trendy my store restocked actually I don't even know if they ever stocked these to begin with because I never saw them and y'all know I'm at Hobby Lobby all the time I never saw them and then I went one day they were fully stocked with these and another one that I'm about to show they were fully stocked and I asked them and they said oh do you need some more we have more in the back and I was like I thought y'all were sold out so I bought I think I originally had a bunch in my car I was like I'd rather have more than enough and not enough and then I was like well let me save some for other people so I ended up I think buying five packs of these and then I got two packs of these because I was like that'd be perfect for our tree in here and I don't plan on using these on the living room tree or the dining room tree just in the bedroom tree but I love them so much so I think I got five of these two of these and they also restocked these which I mentioned that I wanted these and they were sold out they did restock them I didn't even realize they had any but these were originally $9.99 so these were five dollars each I think I got five of them for our tree in here yes they are glass so we're going to try to secure them on the tree really really well so hopefully and then we have carpet in here so hopefully if the cats knock the tree down or something that hopefully they won't break but I just couldn't resist I think these are so beautiful they're high-end they look like a designer ornament I just think they're the most beautiful thing ever. I do have a handful from the Robert Stanley collections. I'm going to show you those really quick. I don't think they're all going to go on the tree, but I think just definitely these and then the ones I'm about to show next. These are the other ones that I got to go on our tree here in the bedroom. I just think these are so beautiful. And again, these were $5 after the discount. Love these. So the rest of the ornaments I think are more so going to be for like decor or bowl filler or maybe they'll make it on the tree. I don't know yet, but I got this one. I love this so much and it, this one was originally $8.99 so $4.50. I love how much texture it has on it. I love the color. I just think they're so beautiful and just a couple more. I kind of wish I would have got more of this one because I feel like these would be really beautiful on a tree and these were only $7.99 so $4 after the discount and I think these would actually be really beautiful on the tree as well. And then I have one of these like crackly glass. It's like a sort of like a light amber color and these were originally $9.99 and then the last one is this green one and I just noticed it sort of has like an amber color I don't know if you can see because the light is shining through so it kind of has like an amber color and then like a mossy green color so you probably can't tell but the when the light shines through it I can see it but these were originally $9.99 so also five dollars so I think I think that's it for my haul I feel like I had I, I felt 
like I had a lot more stuff than that, but I mean, I feel like I have enough, definitely have enough. This is a lot less than I've been known to buy in the past. I'm very proud of myself for that, but I really hope you guys have enjoyed the haul and yeah. <laughs> I really hope you guys have enjoyed this haul and I hope you're excited for Christmas decorating. I know I'm so excited to start filming those videos, but if you're not already subscribed, I hope you will click that subscribe button because I'll be having my Christmas decorating series coming up very soon. But again, thank you so much for watching and yeah, so I really hope you enjoyed.